Well, good day, farmers. Welcome back to Big Bud Farm Sim Saturday. <laughs> I love Big Bud. It's so awesome. Uh, anyways, today, what are we going to do today? We should probably do a crop today. Uh, yes, of some sort. Um, okay. Uh, could just back Bud out, but let's, uh, be our door number one. Oh, well, that's not gonna work. We got a trailer. Very nice, shiny trailer in the way. It almost looks blue, doesn't it? Almost looks blue. Nice. So, that's not gonna work. I probably could drive Big Bud right over that. Let's, uh, let's try just for fun here. Uh, I think Big Bud will just push the trailer or will he drive right over it? Oh no, it's gonna hit on the grill. Okay, never mind. It was a valley pepper, but. Not gonna work. So, we'll uh, go this door. It's good enough we can. Oh, that guy's messing up a bit. Oh well, that's alright. Uh, I think our huge harvesting, or sorry, sewing machine is back here. What are we gonna plant today? Well, I don't know. I don't know what we're going to plant today. Um, it's got to be one of these, I guess. Maybe we'll do... Canola pays really good, but... Um, hmm... Don't really want to get into potatoes again. Cotton's really good, but I don't have cotton equipment, and I haven't attempted to try cotton yet. But I guess we, I guess we could. We could look at the price of cotton uh, equipment and see cotton technology. So that is the harvester. Woo! It's not cheap. It's not cheap. It's like a big baler, really, I guess. So, okay, so that's that. Um, hmm. I am not too sure if it's planters or what I need to plant. Okay, cotton there. Um, now. Okay, so it's not that guy. Uh, okay, let's see here. That one would work. All these will do it. Even the little guy. Even the little guy. Okay, so it's under planters for sure. So now we're gonna look at width, 12 meters, 18.2. Well, we'll go with that one, I suppose. That's a kind of a cool looking machine. Good, okay. Um. Need one of those, boy. I ooh, that's a pretty narrow machine, isn't it? Don't know if I'll get it all done today if we just go with one. But for four hundred eighty-five thousand, let's spend it. Now we don't have much at all. Um, okay, so now for picking up the bale, I'm not too sure. Baling technology, no, I need more like, uh, I might be able to just use my front loader and put it on a trailer. Um, let me think. 
think now. Let me think now. Let me think now. Um, my auto loading trailer. Will it do those? Where did it go now? mods. That's not what I was looking for. Um, okay. I don't think it's under low loaders. No. Um, give me one sec. I'll see if I can find it. Hang on. That's right. It was under bailing technology, but I, d I don't, don't know if it's going to work for cotton bales. Um, hmm. It loads everything, I think. Like everything. That's that flat deck aluminum trailer. I don't know if it's going to work, though. Uh, okay. Well, we guess don't really need Big Bud right now. That's just fine. Um, okay, so let me think. What do we gotta do? What do we gotta do? What do we gotta do? We gotta go down and get some bad equipment. So let's let's just do some circles here first, and we'll go down and uh, got a couple of things. Get the door from here. A couple of things I want to bring back on the big flat deck trailer here, minus our pickup truck, of course. Okay. So I do have a mod of the week down at our shop, too. We will have a quick look at it while we're uh, down there picking up this equipment. I want to get the planting started here. Uh, am I going to get that planting machine? Well... We'll have to load it with some seed, too. I've got some seed on the trailer. But I'm not sure if it's the same seed. Uh, so pallets. We want pile bags. Yeah, that might be it. Okay. <laughs> couple things I want to bring back down here if they'll fit on the trailer. If not, well, we'll have to bring a uh, tractor down. One is the mod of the week. We'll maybe bring it back home with us. Go right, go right, go right, go right. Thank you. Oh, I didn't see that guy. I wasn't paying attention. And uh, we should be able to get both of these sewing, sewing machines. Oh my goodness. Harvesting machines on here. Let's fold that right out. Okay, the trailer looks small to me for some reason, but anyways. So this, ooh, these might might fit on this trailer, but maybe not. Might be too wide. Can't see under there anyway, so we're kind of driving blind here. This is not quite wide enough for this trailer. It's a nice little trailer, but... Oops, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Looks like we're only going to get one on here. A little bit bigger of a machine than I thought it was. Anyways, that kind of unfolded itself. Not exactly what I wanted to happen, but anyways, that's all right. Uh, yeah, we might get the mod of the week on here. The mod of the week. Oh, that's funny. The little uh, skid steers back down on the ground. You remember we put it up in the forks last week, but anyways. There's our mod of the week, a Can-Am Outlander with ridiculously huge tires. 
John Deere Green, of course. <laughs> Might fit on the back of the trailer. Maybe, potentially, we might not be able to fold up our... Uh, might not even fit on this trailer. Might, uh... Yeah, it's funny. It's too wide, maybe. Okay, well, if we just, uh, slowly fold up our tailgate. Kind of like that end jump out of that right time it'll stop that from going up and yeah pretty good so that's quite a crazy looking machine isn't it i don't know why someone made this put big huge tires on it but uh there's a comment there last week can you do an atv or a uh john deere gator or something like that i'm like yep sure i got one of them so there you go we'll give him a little ride around a little bit later on Let's see if we can get back up to Arm up here with this pretty wide load. And I'll bring a tractor of some sorts down to uh, pick up that sewing machine. Oh, better wait. Oh, yeah, of course you got to come this way, don't you, there, bud? Okay, nobody else come down here. All right, because we pretty much got to go up the middle of the road here, I believe. Get through here anyways. I love the people that come and put those signs back up after I, whoop, after I crash through and knock them over. It's so nice of them. <laughs> so we're going to attempt to do the whole field today. I don't know actually if I can have a helper drive one of these or not. I guess they would know when it's full and they would dump the bale out, but uh, I don't know. Alright, let's uh, just pull this guy off to the side here. Too bad, we'll get the can am off here first. Huge Mondo tires. Oops. Really big tires, apparently. It's supposed to go 110, so that's pretty crazy. Okay, let's find a tractor. Oh yeah, I left this guy over here uh, by our trailer. I was going to buy this little chunk of land here, but I don't think I can now. Um, where was that? It's over... Over here? No. Oh, right here. 200 and... No, 676. I can't do that now. So I was going to do that because then I could... You know... <laughs> uh, yeah, this guy work. Okay, let me just look on here to see what I got for seed. Yeah, I've got three seeds here, so just haul this guy out. Should be enough to fill that one. No, by uh, yeah, it might be enough to fill that one. I don't, I can't remember. don't know how much that sewing machine holds. So. We might have to go down and get more seed. Okay, let's go get that thing. We'll get them planted. I'm not too sure if I have to put put fertilizer in that sewing machine or not. Does cotton get fertilizer? I guess it would. Fertilizer of some sorts. Yeah, 
Yes, cotton will be different. I have not attempted at all ever before cotton, so that'll be an interesting, an interesting maybe plant. And this is just a drag guide here. We could uh, hook this up to one of. The, oh, okay then. I don't know why it's done that. That's kind of strange. So now I'm kind of concerned. I wonder if I already have a sewing machine that would plant that stuff. I got a few there. I know that one doesn't do it. Unless I totally missed. That's potatoes, because this one does corn and everything. No. Just this one. Okay, so I don't know why that is doing that. That's really weird. strange. Very, very strange. I don't know why. Why that is doing that. Um, okay. We'll have to maybe figure out something else. This has a hitch on it, but I don't know if this will hook to that guy or not. I gotta do with this thing, I wonder. Huh. I mean, it looks like the hitch is good and low, but it seems to... Weird. Well, let's bring down, I guess. We'll bring Bud down. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what to... I don't know what to make of that. Might do the same thing to Bud here. Wouldn't that be funny? The thing weighs like two million pounds and it's gonna... A tongue of a... Sewing machine's gonna lift it off the ground. Don't think that's gonna happen, but hey, I didn't expect that to happen either, so who knows? Who knows? Really weird. Strange and I don't know. Couldn't see this doing this. Lifted butt off the ground. Oh, 
That seems to be all right there. Weird. I don't know. Comes in threes, apparently. Okay, so let's head her up here. Hopefully there's no train whipping through here. Zoom out a bit so it's not so loud while we're driving. Sorry, son, I can't do much about that. And we'll go see how much seed we're gonna need. We're, I don't know if this is gonna go through seed really fast or if the seed's small, I, I don't know. We shall seed, huh, seed. Some more seed, but that's okay, we can get that. That didn't go too far. Alright, I guess we're going to use Big Bud for this job. I kind of didn't really plan on that, but I was going to get Bud going with something else. But anyways, there we go. So, a whole field of cotton. Oh boy, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do all that today or not. seed this up, and I don't think we need to fertilize that, which is kind of good. Water, bud. And, uh, okay, so what do we got left to bring down there? We gotta bring up another one of those. I think I'm just gonna drive it. Oh, uh, boy, I can't believe that did that. That is weird. But anyways... more seeds down here. We'll bring the uh, trailer down and load that trailer up with seed. Although I could use my flat deck trailer and do it that way. I wouldn't have to load it. Ooh, go quick! Ah! That was close. Um, we could bring our flat deck down on the back of the big, big truck and um, maybe load those pallets that way. That might be a better way to do it. like 15 or 20 whatever I don't know if we double stack them on that trailer I know, I know it did with the, uh, the the bales last week there we double stacked I'm so excited I remember last week and some of you has left a comment too that there is a hay snake straw snake hay snake baler wrapping system coming out that'll wrap them into a huge long snake i cannot wait to try that i have wanted one of those since fs 13. that's what three versions ago <laughs> and finally we're gonna get one so i am so stoked about that i can't wait that's a dlc you have to download from the giants website uh, i guess we don't need this trailer now so we're just gonna park it in the yard here we'll grab the other trailer so whenever that DLC comes out, I think it was the 24th. As of right now, this is the 19th that I am recording this on the Wednesday before the Saturday. I always do my recording a little bit before, so it gives time for, you know, editing, rendering, um, uploading, all that lovely YouTube stuff. Let's just leave that layer. This guy here. Oh yes, we also need to feed the cows silage today at some point. Probably between times. Uh oh. Might have to walk up the diff. Uh, probably between the times when this stuff's growing or maybe a harvesting or something. There we go. Okay, let's head her down. I like this trailer. This trailer's really cool. Super, super light. Well, looks light anyways. Aluminum. 
All right, let's go down and load up some seed. We might as well just load her. We can just load it, load it. This, I, I guess it'll work. I don't know. I, I never tried that, but we'll give her a shot. Let's get at her here. I know there's a couple down there to try already. Um, okay, so we need to change. Ah. Mission pallets. That's probably what we're wanting. Come on, turn. Mission pallets. Mission pallets. Lumber pallets. Egg boxes. Oh, sweet. Cotton modules. There we go. It does do it. Awesome. That's exactly what I wanted. Pallets. I don't know which one it is yet, but it turned on here anyways. If they go on, well, there we go. It goes on. There we go. It goes on. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is just leave that park there. We're going to go into our buying screen. Bio bags. Now I'm presuming it's going to dump them right next to that trailer. And we'll go out of buying these. They should be all on the trailer. Do we think that's going to work? Probably not. But who knows. Let's check here. Oh yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. We can put a few more on. That's what I'm talking about. That's efficiency. One, two, three more, maybe. Let's go three more. I'm just going to buy all seed right now. Let's just buy an extra one for fun. See if it loads. That extra one load. Okay. Yeah, that's all it can load. Okay, so that is perfect. Tension belts don't work, of course, so that's just even more perfect. That is a pretty sweet trailer. All right, we should have enough seed here for about six freaking years, at least, of seed. Be a little further than that, but that's not too bad, I guess. Although he has screwed up already. Yes, he has, and he's probably out of seed. No, he's got lots of seed left. Something made him mess up there for some weird reason. I think I'm going to go this way. have to unload them off that trailer. Might have to unload them on cover. And... Yeah, they, they don't like to be on the trailer. Okay, so that's fine. We can do that. That'll just as easy. But let's go put them up here somewhere. Position B. I'm coming, bud. Just chill out. And we want to. I unload. Oh, there we go. Fantastic. Okay, let's go grab Bud. Bud. Bud, that's a lot of seed. A lot of money too. But anyways, there we go. 
didn't kind of think he might not have liked unloading right off that trailer into these things, but that's okay. Close enough. Okay. Let's get him started back here again. seed left. That's good. Got our two harvesters. That's good. I guess we'll whip down and bring that tractor back. And uh, I don't know whether we're going to need that loader track or uh, big loader so we might uh, sell him. I couldn't see us Really, I couldn't see us really needing that big loader, so get him uh, selling back. Get some moolah back for him, because we're not short on money, but we're not as good as we were, we'll say. Whoa. Take this trailer back with me, too. Trailer. Pretty good little trailer, actually. It's funny that one front tire is hardly hitting the ground because it's up so high. <laughs> yeah, that works, I guess. Oh, crap, this isn't my road. Oops, my bad. My bad. I don't know whether I will be able to hire a helper. Those machines here. Uh, this guy may be worried and I'll just sell him back. We're not really ready to do biogas yet. That might be one, one day we'll maybe do that, but uh, since we're right now. So, well, not going to give us very much for it. That's horrible. All right. It's probably better if. Um, why am I not seeing my equipment here? <laughs> This guy. Okay, so yeah, we can hire a helper, so that's good. That's good. So, I'm not too sure if I need to fertilize. Fertilize zero, so probably need to. But I'm not too sure if I need to fertilize it now. Or 
first growth stage. That I'm not sure of. So let's get in line over here for a moment and we'll see uh, what it's going to say to us on the map. Just fold it out. I think we're just going to fertilize it anyways, but whoa, a big jump. Okay, what's this map saying? So it's growing fruit types growth. Soil composition. I don't know if we need to fertilize this or not. I'll let Bud come up and head down once more, and then maybe we'll run down with fertilizer and see if that see if that does anything or not. Yes, I am not too sure if we need to do this or not. Um, fertilizing, fertilizing cottons. That be a necessity, or, or would it just be more like a tree or a bush? Let's give her some fertilizer and see. Looks like it's putting some down. Let's check the map. Does the map show anything? Oh, well, it does, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Well, that's good. Looks like Bud is going to exceed us, so that is good. And, uh... Yeah, by the time we get down there, he'll be probably down a turner and coming back. So we should have enough. Oh, yeah, that should be enough for the next one there. So that's good. Well, while these guys are spraying and having fun, shower time! Uh, oh, he saved me. While they're having some fun, we'll take our little ATV for a little rip around maybe and see what she'll do. I think those are like baler tires. <laughs> Looks like baler tires. It's funny. Oh, we're almost up to full. There we go. Full speed ahead. Ooh, oh, that kind of hurt. Oh, got a bit of air. Whoa, we. This is just silly. <laughs> wow. Steering does not like to steer when you're going really fast. So. Oh! We're still good! <laughs> if you can believe that, we're still good. And we're still good. Has no problem getting over this track, which is nice. Maybe we'll call it up here. Oh no! Oh, we're good. We're all terrain vehicle. I think that might be a bit too deep. They're all wanting to let me on there. Oh, holy! <laughs> there we go.
Uh oh. We're good. <laughs> Boy, these great big tires on this little machine, these, these things should float. Oh, there's a shipwreck over here. I didn't know that. Well, that's kind of cool. Huh. Fishing boat or something. He's all wrecked. Oh, that's kind of cool. I didn't even know this was here. Interesting. Uh-oh. She's going to start. Well, let's see how far around the uh, shoreline we can get here with this thing. Oh, that's nasty. There's, there's garbage all up here. I didn't even know that either. Look at all that garbage. Oh, man. That's not right. Oh, it might be too deep here. I don't think it's going to let me over here anyways. Not looking too good. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, I guess that's the end of that thing. Oh, that's not good. I can't even... Well, you can see the underneath of it if you wish. Well, I think I am totally stuck. Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, well. We'll just leave it there. I'll have to reset them. Well, looks like we're doing pretty good here. Um, okay, where was that? We got to there. It was over by the water here somewhere. Uh oh. No, that's not what I want. Why am I not seeing? Probably in the wrong map, aren't I? No, it is. It is this map. I am sure of it. I am sure. Oh, well, I'll figure that out later. Not a big deal. All right. I don't think. Wide enough here. Or are we wide enough for hole width? Pretty close, anyways. This would probably go faster if we had a bigger tractor on here, but. This is not working too bad, I guess. That ATV was kind of neat, but kind of silly, really, <laughs> in an essence. But anyways, we had a, a little fun with her there, and then I kind of wrecked her, and yeah. That's what happens. So, uh, looks like Buddy's going to be, oh, definitely one more and a bit swipe layer, and then we, I think, should be able to get the rest of that done with one more swipe.
but yeah, he's going to have to do one more down. That's not too bad. We should be able to cross past each other here without any interference. Hopefully. It's looking pretty good. It's going to be close, though. Come on, we can do this. We can do it. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, we that was perfect. That was perfect. Um, it looks like we got some extra stuff to plant down here after and some fertilizer to do as well, by the looks of things. They're still not wanting to come down here. It's probably because of that tree. That tree, they don't seem to like. And it might be from when I had those buildings. They're still... I don't know. Let's see, he was going to stop there again. Okay, and I'll just double check the planting if it's sort of hard to tell if that was planted or not down here. Um, it looks like he got all the way down. Yeah, he's getting all the way down, so that's good. So he's got one more swipe. We'll uh, maybe run with him here for a moment. Close those covers, but I think it's all right. We might do uh, sped up fast time growth cycles of the cotton here to see uh, how it is, because I've never seen it before. So, be interested to see that in a fast times kind of thing. markers here too, but I don't kind of really need them now. Something. I want to see. 
see this. Oh, I guess I'll just end here. Won't turn. I want to see those wheels turn back there when it was under control of the bots here. But anyways, there we go. We are planted. We'll run up the um, sprayer. Bud worked well. We'll leave him there for a moment and head up here with our sprayer. So I know these um, make really huge bales, so that's kind of neat. But uh, boy, they're not very wide, so it's going to take us a while, I think, to get through this field. I don't know how many bales we'll get out of it. I don't know how far you have to go to get a bale in that machine. So we'll see, I guess, when she's ready to harvest here. We'll, uh, we'll do that fast time growth cycle, so I like to see that in fast time. It's kind of neat. in place there too. While we're just going here and waiting, we'll just check into the animals. Productivity's down a bit on the pigs, um, probably because of the cleanliness. Chickens are cleanliness. Cows are missing some grass. And our mixed ration. We should get some grass cut up too, maybe for them. Although I got my tractor down at the trailer right now, so. And horses are pretty good right now. They don't seem to use much food. So that's good, I guess. Oh, well, I haven't really, haven't fast-timed stuff very much, so. Right, so we'll do a fold this guy up and we'll do a gross cycle fast times stage thingy. And uh, probably just gonna stand up on top of the tractor here. It's high enough. Good. Um, guess that'll work. Sure. Okay, well, let's get at our fast time, and here we go.
Okay, I noticed just while this was going here that we're only 50% fertilized. So we actually might need to do this after this first growth stage again. So, I'll uh, maybe... Spare containers, maybe over here. I think there might be one. Okay. Oh, that didn't go too far. <laughs> what was this one? What was it there? Herbicides. Those are herbicides. So that's not going to work. No. It's been a while since. I'm cutting through, but it's been a while since I have build up this thing now I can't remember what I've got at my farm I think I do have a liquid fertilizer still there if it works it's been kind of these things I don't know I think they're conflicting with other mods in the game that I'm using so probably that's what's going on there we go okay we are full so I'm going to set this guy out again, just double make sure that we are getting 100% fertilized because I want a lot of bales out of this. It's going to be awesome to load that trailer right to the you-know-what with bales of cotton. Now we've got to figure out where they go after that because I don't know. Mama, not that much. What about there? Okay, so if we get out now, it says 50% fertilized, so... Send the old buddy out there and uh, see what it is. It should go up to 100%. 800, yeah, okay. So he's going to have to uh, fertilize that again, so we'll let him finish that, and then we'll finish our growth stage. All right, there we go. We are grown. Okay, we got to put this guy away. And we'll get a guy harvest in here. That's kind of neat. It's all fluffy. Fluffy and white. Whoops. My bad. Oh, crap. <laughs> All right, now let's get one of these guys going here. 
He'll unload them. Get them opened up. We'll do our first bail here. pretty quick actually. Oh, I think we're going to have to go a long way to get a bail. That's kind of cool. It leaves a plant there. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. We're going to let him go and uh, we'll get the other guys started here on the other side. Boy, I don't know if this is going to get us a whole lot of bales out here. I've, I, I've never done cotton before, so maybe I'm thinking, you know, I'm used to thinking we're going to get a whole bunch of bales out here. We might only get like three. <laughs> Something like that. I don't know what a bale is. Uh, cotton's worth here, but time way down there. Oh, I forgot. I'm still whipping along there. I'm going to give this guy a little overlap. Okay. All of a sudden, my tractor stuff all came back, so I don't know. I don't understand that. That this did, but compress it or something. Oh, cool. I am not too sure. I guess we can compact an awful lot of cotton into this system. change sound all of a sudden. That was weird. Is it compressing it again or something? I don't know. So I think we're going to be a while until we can get a, uh, a bail in this thing. I didn't realize it would be so, so long, so I don't think that's really telling me anything up there. It must be compressing it or something.
interesting. Well, maybe, uh, maybe we'll do another little bit of a fast time here, because this is going to probably take a wee while. So, uh, why don't we, we do that? Let's we'll start right now. Finally, almost going to get a bail here, and uh, boy, that's, uh, that's a lot of cotton. So we might get, we're going to get two bales anyway. We've got three. <laughs> so I guess this is a good crop for a really huge field. Seven, we're almost full. So like a really huge field, like, well, this one's kind of funny shaped, but. 
could definitely get a lot of bales, well, probably three or four out of this number eight. But anyways, we're going to we're gonna stop there. I'm gonna take over control. Okay, I want to see this happen here. What do we got to do? Unload Baylor. Why? Why? Yeah, look at this thing. How many t-shirts are in there? Looks like a huge marshmallow poop. That's what you say. Well, that's pretty darn cool. Alright, it's too bad it takes so much feel. That's seems like a lot, doesn't it? But uh, this one should be around in the 80s somewhere. 94. Well, let's see what he does when he gets a full bale. So we might get one more bale out of here, but I uh, don't know whether I'm going to get the second guy to help or not, because I don't know if I can dump out a half a bale out of this machine. So, we might just let him continue on and uh, get one, maybe two more. Oh, maybe I'll let this guy go, who knows, we'll do some more cotton eventually here, but I might uh, purchase that big field when I can uh, over there and do that full of cotton. I think that's Biggest field, although these two would be fairly big if knitted together, but I don't want to get too far away from our farm here, right? This is our farm here, that's where we are. So I think we bought number eight, we'd get uh, well, that's one, two, we'll probably get three maybe bales out of there. So that's one, two, three, maybe four out of there, too. So but it's a good field. There he goes. There's a good field to, uh, it's a good crop to just kind of let him go while uh, we do other things. Big, greasy marshmallow. <laughs> That's pretty cool. But down here, going to the cultivator. Big butt here too. If So we'll cultivator back up. Um, I don't think we'll do another crop today in here, uh, but next week uh, something. I uh, want to see to what is cotton worth. Cotton is worth at my sell point seven thousand dollars a bale. That's pretty good, actually. <laughs> and. Uh, Hmm. That's interesting. Oh, so spinner would be the other one that we'd have to take it to. I guess there's only one place. So that's kind of cool. That's sell points a little ridiculous, but oh, we're making good money. Why not, eh? Darn it, we messed up a little bit there on the edge. Oh, well. 
So we got two bales. Let's get our big truck. Darn it. Actually, now that my map's working again here. Oh, what the heck? No. Oh, there. I just zoomed out too much. Okay, I understand that now. There. Reset. Okay. Uh, yeah, we need our, our truck. We're going to pick up these bales. Uh, okay, so we got to change. Um, Okay, turn on the auto loader, and away we go. Oh, they're a little bigger than you think. They're, uh, well, we're only going to get maybe three on this trailer at once. It looks like a great big chunk of compressed snow. And, uh, yep, lashing doesn't work on that either, so that's great. Oh, there goes Buddy back on her way up again. <laughs> Don't know why he's doing that. Really good at backing up, though, I must say. Um, backing up the trailer or the uh, cultivator and uh, articulating tractor. He's done really well. Okay, well, we'll take this back up. And uh, we'll actually go over to the other side. Do a little bit there. Or Bring them down one more here and do another row and then on the other side another couple rows and let these guys work in the middle here a little more. Got some stuff in stock. That we could take in. We have uh, hmm. We got lots of wheat. No barley. Yeah. Got some we could take, and we could take some oats in, but that's for the horses, even though they don't seem to be using too much. Uh, everything's just kind of flat lined right now, so I think I'm just gonna hang on to stuff right now. Not uh, too worried about getting that field right today. And how much did we say that was? One point two million. Million dollars. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money, and I don't think we're gonna get into that today. Um, hmm. These guys. 
guys are getting closer to the end here, so what I will probably do um, is put this guy onto the other side after. That'll give them a little more time in the middle. little more overlap. And we'll go back to these guys. Uh, Stop this guy there until we get uh, one more bail done in that other one, maybe. And then let this guy finish the rest. Maybe we'll get another bail out of him. It takes a long time to get a bail, that for sure. But while these guys are going, Keep an eye on that guy cultivating. I want to clean up at our pens. Go in and check the cows too. I think they're okay. So we need to make them some Wasn't too bad. Oh, this 
stuff. I don't know what I'm doing on the pilot here. Now, how do they look? Are they 100% clean? Oh, I guess it'll take a moment. Re-register up there. Okay, grass. We need to get some grass. And it's probably quicker to go. Ooh, better check this guy. Should be right for a minute. We'll bring our mower back because uh, I can't buy this right now. So. Make a driveway into the, <laughs> the trailer there eventually. this road. Well, he can do one more, I think, there, and then we better halt him because he's going to be... Stop him. And I don't know why he did that. So that is halting right there. How about that? And let's jump in there and see how he's doing. Just about ready to puke at another one, but not quite.
right around here. Orange right back. wings up and uh oh. guess these cows really don't get outside and apparently that wasn't enough for them. So, how much more do they need? Oh, really close. Probably if I had filled that trailer, it would have been good. So, I'll, I'll just leave it at that. It should be pretty good. So, we don't have stuff... Uh, machinery for... I don't have machinery to feed them. Yet. Maybe next week. I don't know. We'll see. But, uh, I guess I should have been a little bit there. Ooh, ooh, I'm roll that off a bit. Let's see if we can do that right now while we're waiting. Where am I here? Okay, a little more better. And I want to go back to... Okay, so he is just dumping that one off. What I'm going to do is let this other guy go now. So he can mark him before the other guy gets like a partial load coming. Alright, let him go. Fluffy. And we'll jump on the cultivator. Oh, we got to put her down. figure out why he did that. So 
should be able to get, I think, one more bale that the guy just dumped out on our trailer. But I, I don't think it's going to do like double depth kind of thing. don't imagine it's going to do that. And let's grab our truck. Yeah, she goes one more on. I don't imagine it'll double stack. We're gonna try double stacking, but I don't think so. I don't, I don't think it'll double stack. Now I'm kind of wondering, actually, now if this trailer wasn't kind of modeled for length off of these things. It'd be probably the largest thing you'd put on here. Three of them would probably be pretty much a full load. That is my thinking anyways. Should be still an auto work mode. Auto work mode. Should just come right here and pick it up. It does, yeah, that's definitely I think the model for that trailer that line. Salt blocks. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, so we'll jump in with this guy. Should be able to clear everything all right there. Yeah, looks good. I think I should be up around at 50 percent. Silly radio station. hit like five or something like that it starts turning it on but I got my music turned off anyway so percent. that's not too bad we should get one more bail out of them and then there might be a little bit of a partial bail hopefully we get one more bail I think we should we should be able to get one be able to clear past it easily enough here.
67%. Definitely should hopefully get in the mail. Oh, darn close. Here's hoping. Snake Baylor, so probably next week. Let me just look at my calendar. Uh, I think it was the day after this video was made. So, might do a special next week for it. I might, um, I might have to do some grass, do some more bales, and then uh, figure out how that works with that wrapper. We'll maybe look at that uh, just before we leave today, and I'll show you that mod that's on the Giants website. That's downloadable DLC, which is coming up. So I think it's the 24th of the point. Figure that out. So, I don't know whether I would like to use those pictures I just took for thumbnails, or maybe right in the old truck here again. Seems to look pretty good. Excellent. Okay, that's good. Yes, that guy. Whoop. That guy.
<laughs> a little bit too fast. gonna do uh, okay so I think we can start him again and then come down probably this way we'll finish the rest of that road and uh, go back to helper B How's this guy doing? this and then I'll maybe run it back to get that little bit. And we'll start them to get to finish that little bit. We'll see if that bill will load double load. I, I highly doubt it. So can I uh, 
load finish unfinished bale. Yeah, I guess it can. I don't know if that would load though into our trailer, onto our trailer. This week, I kind of forgot about him. All right, so we've got a minute there. Let's ooh, load up this. We'll see if she'll double load. I doubt it. That is a full load. Okay. Not a problem. We'll go sell this stuff. Dump it out. That's... Switch them over. Bud is rapidly catching up. He's going to be rapidly catching us. I'm probably going to have to move that, yes, to move that bale. Which is fine because I'm pretty sure. Hold on, Bud. Wait, wait, wait. There we go. Okay. So. I'm definitely not going to get down there in time. Obviously. So we'll uh, just let this guy finish this row and then stop him again. Let that feller catch up with the last bit of cotton there. It's looking good. That is a lot of work. I am super glad that I got two machines. I should have probably had three machines, <laughs> really. But I got the two machines, and, uh, you know, honestly, if we didn't have the two machines, we would only be kind of to well, roughly where the guy is now. We would have had probably about another hour and a half. Uh, uh, harvesting. I definitely wouldn't have got it all done today. So I'm glad I got two machines. Because that worked really well. Alright, we'll just halt the little bud there. And uh, now I guess we'll let him finish as we go dump our trailers just right here. Should get a fair bit of green for all this. Get it in here. It's going to be kind of a tricky dump here, but I should be able to manage it. Why? That didn't work. It's supposed to sell it there, but why isn't it selling it there? Sell point is. 72, whoa. Yeah, cell point 150 is 72.88. That's kind of weird.
Nope. It's not going to sell there for some weird reason. So we need to load that back up. Uh, we're going on as you. You. Well, that's strange. Oh, wow. Okay, so we're going to have to take it to the spinnery. Um, we got a bit of changing to do down here. And we got to unload an unfinished bale. Let's see half a bale here. There we go. That's a good one. Finish there. All right. That worked pretty good. That worked pretty good. Now. Spinnery, spinnery, spinnery is right there. Oh, let's get uh, the rest of the field cleaned up here. So, spinnery is... Oh, we have to kind of go into town, so maybe I'll just come right around this way and then into town, past the gas station, and there, there we go. All right, we'll take her down there to sell, I guess. It's not going to be worth quite as much, but that's okay. Seems like a lot of work for what we're going to get out of this. Sell this up. So into town, in by the store, down by the gas station. And just kind of keep going on the left. That should be all right. Sharp turn here. Tight, sharp turn. Yep, took the sign out. Down by the gas. Taking all the signs out. That's perfect. Gotta go the right way. It's down here and then down the bottom. So turn to the right. I can see the green thingy over there. I did the placement marker thing there. So it's not too bad. I don't know how you'd load these, um, I guess with a fork. Set of forks and load that with that attachment. Okay, the spinnery. Right. Now, I'm not too sure where to go here, but I guess that's showing me exactly where I have to go. And that's where we're going. There we go, $189,000 for those bales. Wait a minute, that doesn't sound right. $189,169. That's $63,000 a bale. Okay, what is this? What is this measurement then? It's telling me $3,152. So, I don't know, because I got $63,000 a bale there. <laughs> so, that's worth it now. Cotton, that's definitely worth it. So it wouldn't be bad to maybe buy that great big field when we can next, and... do that and cotton just let them go at it they'll unload they'll do everything I just go pick them up after we can do our own uh, our own crop in our fields there's some 
canola or something, maybe we'll try that next week. I don't know if I can afford that field. If I take some some commodities in, I can probably probably swing it. It's 1.2 million, I think it was. I might be able to swing it. Look at that partial deal too. We should take it in. Wait till next week. Pretty good turn there. It's tight though. Alright, so I guess that's it for the farming. I do want to look on the Giants website just before we go and um, Check that out. Looks like the field's clean. That's good. I wonder if I should pick up those seeds. I think I will. Can okay, we change? Okay, there's one copper. Pallets. There we go. Put them inside, maybe. Put them in the John Deere building. Well, that's it for Farm Sim today here. Anyways, we'll uh, jump on the Giants website here and uh, we'll have a look at that Hay Snake mod. Just one second. All right, there it is. Uh, pre order now. I don't really understand why they want you to pre order it when you could just get it the same day it comes out. It's not like you get any. Well, maybe you do get other stuff. Well, I don't know. Uh, but that's it. So there's a bunch of other stuff too. That looks like a trailer. It's 10 bucks USD. It's not too bad. Uh, so there's a round bell wrapper and there's a square bell, I think, back there. Should be a picture of it. Yeah, so it wraps them into like, hey snakes. Different colors of wrap too. So that's kind of neat. I think there was a... Wow, what is that? I don't know what they're growing there, but it's huge, tall stuff. And then logging stuff to... Uh, wood, wood baler. What? Oh, what? Okay, I don't know which is which now. Baler. It looks like a baler, doesn't it? Hay snake baler. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff with it here. This is not a kind of a picture of everything. March 26th, 2019. So I think that's a Monday. Yeah, Tuesday. So it's a week today. It's to come out. So, anyways, we'll look at all these here too. Uh, one, I believe, is for... One is for round, and one is for square. This one here, I th well, I don't know. You know, I don't, I'm not too sure which one is which. This is bailing technology. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I've seen a picture, though, of one that was doing square bales. This is just an individual wrapper where these are the... I guess you feed it there and it goes in and then it just kind of keeps pooping out so I think this is maybe going to be the square baler but you know I'm not too sure I'm not too sure but uh, there is uh, something for chopping up hay or straw I guess uh, that's a wrapper 
Um, veiling technology. I'm, I'm not too sure what that one is. <laughs> and another veiling technology. It's probably the wagon. Another bailing technology. Another bailing technology. There's quite a bit of stuff in here. Bailing technology. Bumper. And then there's uh, forestry stuff. So that looks pretty cool. Now, the website I've got up here, um, FS2019. Let's look up cotton. Cotton. What's available for cotton? Well, trailers. Bale sales. Not too much by the looks of things. So, I guess we're stuck with that machine until someone maybe potentially comes out with a new one. Uh, there's a, oh, that's kind of neat. A loader pack for picking up those big bales. I guess that would be handy. Yeah, I would say. Great big, that looks even like a bigger bale, that one, but anyways. There's a cr new crops and weed control. Hmm, I don't see anything there. And I've got this one here, Mods for Games. I don't really use this one much, though, but... Uh, um, does for spin, does a bunch of different stuff for me. Assuming they're 19... Cotton, cotton harvester are two, 200 meter plus. Work range of 200 meters. I don't really understand that. With a width of 200 meters. What? That's like the whole field. Why would you want it that big? That's silly. I just want a little bit bigger, but that one might be a little bit bigger. John Deere cotton picker. Here's a cotton picker. Uh, see if it gives us a size on it. It might be bigger, but it's hard to tell by that. Slow down the rear hatch opening. Does not work with hired worker. Oh, well, I need hired worker. I'm sorry. I can't do all that myself. There's another one, but it looks pretty narrow. I think we're at a luck. But anyways, that's all we can do. Uh, just going off topic here a bit. I'm just wondering what spin, spin tires. Oh, tractors and spin tires. There you go. Cars, tractors, bus. Really? In the mud? Come on. That would be just horrible. Huh. Uh, spin tires, mud runner actually is the one I'm running now. Well, that'd be pretty cool. Huh. I haven't installed mods for that game yet, so I'm not really too sure how to do that. But Badlands revisited. Yeah, looks really bad. But anyways, that's it for Farm Sims Saturday today. Thanks again for watching. A little off topic there, but. Uh, uh, Farm Simulator 19. Let's just browse a couple of them. See uh, cars. I don't know why. Why? Ooh, that's kind of cool. Play Polaris Razor. But anyways, that's it. Thanks again for watching. Catch you all next week, and you guys have a good week.